why is the Navy specifically able to combat a cyber threat? Do you see a correlation from what we do at sea to, for our organization, what we're able to do within cyberspace? Yeah, I do. Uh, the reason the Navy is uh, so involved in this is by virtue of how we live, we've been in the cyber domain. I mean, when I say live, how we do our business. Uh, we were fortunate enough, and actually people before us were smart enough to realize, hey, we need to understand this cyber thing, this electromagnetic spectrum. We need to develop cyber warriors. And so we stood up uh, the Fleet Cyber Command a number of years ago, 2009. We stood up our own fleet, which is in charge of all of our networks. So we have number, it's called 10th Fleet. We have numbered fleets around the globe that are responsible for our aircraft and our ships and our submarines. Well, we also, uh, and they're, they're geographically located. So the 7th Fleet out in the Western Pacific, the 6th Fleet in the Mediterranean, the 5th Fleet in the Arabian Gulf. We have the 10th Fleet responsible for all of our networks around the world. It's a little unique, but it's also very smart to bring all of your networks and organize, train, and equip your people to operate and understand, defend your networks, and how to use them most efficiently. So we were smart enough to do that early on and develop it, and it's, a, it's proper for the Navy to understand how to do that because we go to sea and we use radars all the time. We communicate so much, again, using electromagnetic network, satellite uh, bouncing, et, et cetera. It's just inherent in the way we do business.